In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add your own custom-made affiliate banner to your WordPress website or blog. By that, I basically mean that you create your own image banner and then you add the um, affiliate link to that banner. So if, if, for example, it gets displayed on your website and somebody clicks on that banner, it then gets directed to the appropriate website you're promoting and the product and you get paid if a purchase is made and so on. So if for for example, I've made my own banner. In terms of making your own banner, I've used a program called um, Serif Draw Plus 8. Um, if you do a Google search for make a banner, there are, there are a few websites which will help you kind of make a banner. Or perhaps you can even use some free stock images to promote products. As long as the, the um, banner is basically factual and truthful and doesn't kind of mislead people, it should be completely fine with your affiliate program. But if you're not sure, just double check just in case. Um, so. If I wanted to add this um, banner to my website and then add the affiliate code, it's quite a simple process. So what we want to do is go to your WordPress website. So make sure you log into your WordPress website. Then you want to add a free plugin called Advanced Ads. This is um, completely free. There's also a paid version with extra options if you need it. So I'll put this link in the description. It's called Advanced Ads by um, Thomas some sort. Um, so basically, um, I've downloaded this program to my PC, so then I'm going to go to my WordPress website. I then want to select the plugins from the um, left hand side. So once you're on the plugins page, click Add New. Then right at the top, click Upload Plugin. Choose the file on your PC. I can see Advanced Ads there in my folder. Then click the Install Now button. Once that's installed, click the Activate Plugin. So that's now activated. You can now see on the left-hand side, it's listed as Advanced Ads with um, several options. So before we begin, we need to upload the banner or the image you've just created or downloaded from the internet to your WordPress website. So you go to Media, and then from Media, you basically click the Add New button and then add the um, the image or the banner to your WordPress website. As you can see, the banner is listed here. I've listed two colors. So that, that's now listed in the media library. So then you, we can go back to advanced ads, click on ads. So basically this is my first ad I'm adding. So we can see right at the top here, it says enter the title, enter whatever you like. I'm just gonna call mine test ad. So then we have add type. So there's a few options here, as you can see right at the top, basically any ad network, Amazon, customize AdSense code and so that. We don't want a code because we're adding an image. So we can either use rich content, which is basically the um, standard WordPress editor, or we can add image ads. So to keep things simple, I'm gonna add an image ad. When, when you do this, also make sure that if you have any ad blockers installed, make sure they're um, disabled on your website unless this won't work. So once I selected image ad, select image. From my media library, I can select the banner. So select that and then choose insert. So there's the banner. So then basically, the next option is the URL. So basically most websites, affiliate websites such as Amazon and eBay, allow you to add a short piece of code or a short piece of URL. In my case, if you just go to Amazon, you can get a code like this, or a URL I mean, sorry. So basically, copy the URL and add it to the link. So that is basically my affiliate link. So when people click on that, it will redirect them to the appropriate um, page or product and you'll also get paid if a purchase gets made. So basically that's it. So um, there are other options such as position. You can choose the margin, whether it's you know kind of placed slightly above the text or you know completely flush to the text or your kind of site title and so on. 
Um, there's also other options such as display conditions, visitor conditions. Um, feel free to experiment with these. For example, display conditions, you can choose something like specific pages and you can kind of block the ad from being shown on certain pages, which is a nice feature just in case they don't, uh, in case they break the kind of terms and conditions of the affiliate program. So basically, um, you can leave most of these blank and you can just experiment with them if you like. So I'm just going to leave them blank. So I've added my my banner image and I've added my um, affiliate link. So next next process is to click publish. So then it gives you the option of where you want your ad to be displayed. So there's a few options on here. So I, I basically used a um, horizontal banner. So I want to choose one of these ones so I can before content, within the content, after the content. Um, this is for obviously sidebars for vertical kind of um, banner ads and so on. So I'm just going to choose before content. So basically, that is it. Congratulations, your ad is now vis visible in in the front end. So if I go to my blog now. So if I click on a post, we should then see the banner ad I've just added. Ignore that warning, that's just a basic warning. Oops, let's go back a minute. So there it is. Get your hands on thousands of free audiobooks and ebooks, and you can see below that is the banner ad I've just created. And of course, if I click on this ad, it then takes me to an Amazon page that I'm promoting and of course up in the URL up here if you scroll along a bit you should see here is basically my Amazon ID so really it's as simple as that so that banner is obviously a lot more attractive than the, the banners you get on Amazon and eBay and if, if you know how to make a banner it's a great system to kind of increase affiliate sales and so on so basically that's how you add a affiliate image banner to your WordPress website. Thanks for watching.